Yo, it's a lion's war, and the stakes are high. Lord Shadow steps up, he's ready to fly. Questions in the air, they start to rain. Can Lord clear his lane without any strain? How many deaths will Lord give out this war? He gotta maintain. Find the best counter for the fender. Lord Shadow skill, he's the ultimate contender. Maps laid out, it's a treacherous path. But Lord's got the skills, he's done the math. Checking the nodes, planning the attack. He's moving forward, there's no turning back. Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 52, and this is war number three. And looks like we're still in tier two. We're going up against an alliance called My Hero Academia. Okay. I actually love that uh, anime. Let's see. Who did they ban? Okay. They banned Ironheart, Silk, and my girl, Lady Deathstrike. See, I'm going to start hating y'all now. That's what's going to happen. All right. Let's see who they got planned all right so that's magneto right there and that's corvus corvus fight that's another corvus fight and for jessica jones hmm um honestly i could take her with uh nick fury if i need to Let's see uh, who I've been assigned to. All right, so Jessica Jones, Chilith or Shang-Chi? Okay, I could do that. It's not a problem. Um, let's see. We got Guardian. He's got Corvus. Good, good. Um, Ant-Man Future, Magneto. Good, good. Red Skull, Corvus. All right, so we see eye to eye. I will bring uh, Chilith out. I don't get a chance to use her all that much. Now, let's see. Did he assign me? No, nope, I'm not assigned to any. Good, good, good. So it'll be another uh, relaxing war for me. If I can just keep from uh, dying on my path. We'll be good. All right. So Red Magneto, Chilith, and uh, Corvus. That looks like it's going to be the play. All right. Let's get on with the fighting. All right. We're going in with Magneto, Corvus, and Chilith. I don't know if I've used Chilith before in war. I'm not sure. However... After this war, I may have to look into her and um, rank her up. So, the um, our alliance leader, war planner for our battle group, he assigned Chile for this fight. And I was like, I wonder why. Now, if you guys watched me use Chile during that crucible, I was running my, you know, ouchie masteries, recoil, you know, and I ended up having to turn them off for that fight. So I hadn't really been looking at her because I thought she would shrug them off, but she doesn't. As you can see, I still have the bleed. I still have the poison off. Okay. But look at this. I'm just getting work. But she does... Um, cleanse any future harmful, you know, uh, debuff. Actually, uh, even the parry stun, all that good stuff. Okay? And look at this. I'm like, whoa! Something else that I saw and why this was such a good option for this fight. You know how Jessica Jones likes to go unstoppable when you fire your special? Well, in her kit, she has a countermeasure for that, and I believe it's on her special one. I think she gets a grit uh, buff, so the unstoppable is no problem for her. So I'm like, wow, I did not know that. So definitely, definitely looking at her with uh, new eyes. 
And here we have Guardian. You guys already know Corvus tears Guardian up. Now, last war, you saw that I tried to evade that and got hit. Now, I also noticed when I saw his health go down, I went, wait a minute. Is he actually running recoil? That's interesting. Makes my life easier. I don't think there's any reason to run recoil now that we have mastery loadouts. I used to run recoil on defense because it costs to keep on switching back and forth, right? And then when they did the mastery loadouts and we didn't have any idea when, you know, we needed to, to be in the right um, mastery, I was like, uh, okay. But then they had the default that you could set. Hey, no more, um, you know, recoil on defense for me. Anyway. All right. Now, this fight is going to be your standard Magneto fight. I learned my lesson. Do not go into this fight with Corvus. That, you will have a bad day. I had a bad day. I remember, and I will not do it again. Even though Corvus gets... Uh, you know, class advantage and all that good stuff? No. Not a good option for uh, this guy. It's not that he can't do it. He can. But you're going to lose health. You're going to lose a lot of health. Um, I think uh, I talked about this before. But on this node, what you have to be careful about is not the bleed debuff, but the bleed effect. Let me explain. You get a bleed debuff on you, right? If you're not bleed immune, you're gonna take bleed damage. However, the bleed debuff does direct damage to you, not bleed damage, okay? So Corvus, for example, does not take damage from bleed. But with that armor up, you'll notice that Corvus is taking damage anyway. And you'll be like, why? Why is that? It's because the damage is actually direct damage from the bleed. So a bleed immune, you won't even get the debuff, so you don't have to worry about it. But if you're not bleed immune, Corvus is not bleed immune. So if you're not bleed immune, now you have to worry about it. Even though he doesn't take any damage from the bleed, he will take damage from the direct damage of it. So yeah, do not want to use Corvus there. You will take damage and you will cry. Now, this fight on the other hand is different. This one is made for Corvus. Red Skull just got a buff. He is a nasty defender, but against Corvus, he can't hang. Corvus, eat him up. Look at this, eat him up. Nasty. How, how 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 fast was that? Was that 12 seconds? Yep, 12 seconds. Corvus. All right, I don't believe I had any other fights in this war. I don't think I was assigned to any more. So we'll be back in a minute, and you'll find out how this war ended. And we're back, and unfortunately, we lost this war as well. So we've got two wars in a row that we've lost, but we're still at Tier 2, so we still have some good points. Um, Yeah, they just spanked us, is what happened. <laughs> Look at that. Uh, shout out to our MVPs. But that is going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching. I don't think... This will knock us out of Tier 2. But we need to win another one if we want to stay in Tier 2. All right, so take care. Hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day. Arena and chill grind, that's how we roll No stress, no drama, just on patrol In the fight he swift, his tactics be tight Those shadows in the arena ready to ignite From the streets to the screen, his skills be renowned In the world of Marvel, Lord, the King Crown